be the day. Mm -hmm. Oh, I thought we wanted to match your t-shirt. What's on your t-shirt that's your favourite thing? T-Rex. Uh, oh, you can be a T-Rex if you want, but I thought you wanted to be a Pteranodon, a flying dinosaur, because they're your favourite thing. How have you got, have you been playing with, you've been playing with my paints, haven't you? Sorry, doing the mum thing of licking. You've got blue paint all over your face all of a sudden. Right, so, no. Right, sit straight. That's for my coat. Yeah, I thought you wanted to be one of your coloured in, I've got a better picture, one of your coloured in Pteranodons. Why yeah? is that one green? Because you coloured it in green. No, I'll just do it in green. You want to do it in green? Okay, well, I'll start off in yellow so I can see where I'm going. Rain rainbow. Rainbow. Yeah, I know you like your rainbows, don't you, bunny boy? So can I have a rainbow pteranodon? Pteranodon, yes, you can. Rainbow pteranodon. All right, so if you just close, I've not done one before. All right, so chin up, try and keep it still. So I'm just going to pop it in, in yellow first so that hopefully I can work out where I'm going with it. They've got quite long skinny wings. They're a bit batty, aren't they? Mm-hmm. But they have a beak. And they do. But no teeth. So it's going to be something like that, I think. Right, try and unscrunch for me. So that's a little bit of yellow. Does that look about right? And why did you put some yellow on? So it's a paler colour, so I'm kind of using it with a sponge just to sketch out where I want to go. All right. So hey, let's. Yeah, you didn't do any rainbows. Yes. Well, then get started. Um, let's do some red because that's your favourite colour, isn't it? Yep. So I'm just going to. Come Wait, it's red paint. Red paint, right? Can you stop doing that to your t-shirt? <coughs> no, don't growl at me, please. It wrecks your t-shirt. Right, sit back. Sit back against the chair. Mm. Yes. No. Sit back against the chair, chin up. Okay, let's just blend that down a little bit. Because that's going to be the top of his wing. So that's doing red, orange and yellow now, okay? We were watching the, the dinosaur sh show about him, weren't we? Yeah. Not long ago. Yeah, and one of the triceratops. Oh, you like triceratops. Maybe we'll do that another day, because I think Mel asked for triceratops. No, I think he asked for tridadodon. I think he asked for this kind of dinosaur. Okay. Okay, that's the edge of his wing. Is it a boy dinosaur, or is it a girl dinosaur? This one? Boy. Boy. Right, um, and their little arms were a little bit different, weren't they? They had kind of shoulders that went like that, and then the arm bone. Right, can you sit back for me? <coughs> you don't growl at me, please. It's a silly noise. Little arm bones were kind of like that. I think. I need to get a better picture of one. Not like that. Okay, can you sit back, stay still? Right, close your eyes gently, so I just need to go in the corner of your eye there to do the corner of his wing. Oh, I've got fluffy hair of my own today. Can you stay still, pet? Oh, my mouth hurts. Your mouth hurts? Why does your mouth hurt? I don't know. Do you just have a different bit hurting every day? Yeah. Okay. Right, so we've got red, orange. Is there any of it gone yet? Has any of what gone yet? My paint. No, no, it's all up on your nose and on your eyes. But this is going to be not, a slower not paint. Not my, not my, next to my mouth. Not next to your mouth, no. Mom, mm -hmm. can I show my, my, you can't, I got like that. At the end, yeah. Let's just do this. I mean, can you just go? Well, my head hurts. Your head hurts? Why does your head hurt? I don't know. You okay. need to scratch it a bit. Okay, well, poke it. Just don't scratch it, poke it. Which bit do you want to scratch? <laughs> right, he's got a bit of a thick neck, because I was thinking dragon, not pterosaur. 
the pterosaurs were flying dinosaurs basically, weren't they? Yeah. And the, no, they were Cretaceous, I think, weren't they? Why are you wiping off his neck? Because I made it too thick. That's a good thing about face paints, you can wipe them off with wet, wet water. Right, so he's got a funny little elbowy bit there. And then I think his hands actually kind of come up there. And then he has little bits like that. So let me just change that a bit. Leave your lips alone, honey. I'm trying to make them better. Okay, what we'll do is we'll go and we'll get some... Um, I've probably got some lips out of upstairs. Um, so he has funny little elbowy bits like that, I think. And then his little fingers come up there. And then he's got a kind of bit like that. Chin up, honey. This is one of the... Um, Reaches. Make it up as you go along ones, isn't it? Uh, oh, well, they, yeah, I think they were meat eaters, weren't they? And then there are some that hunted what? Fish? Yeah, like Spinosaurus. Oh, is that one of the fish hunters? Yeah, right, so that's the guy with a thorns on his back. The thorns on his back, was he? Right, so they had a funny sort of spike on their head that kind of went that way. And then they had a little bit... See, oh, honey, just please stay still and then I can finish this and then we can go, okay. Why do you only decide to have sore bits? I don't know. When we actually start doing something. Just don't touch it, please. And then it'll be okay. Okay. Why are you putting... I'm putting some yellow on because I need to blend this a bit. And you red is on there. Yeah. Why? Because I just used red, didn't I? Yeah, and why are you putting it on there? Because I am. That's where it goes. Well, you're not using it? Yeah. Blend that in a little bit. Alright, so hopefully that's starting to look a bit pteranodon. And he has funny little boxy body, doesn't he? Where's your t-shirt? He's got a little triangular body that comes down kind of like that. And then he's got funny wee legs that go kind of like that. Let's leave it all alone, Bubba. Just leave your lips alone. And he's got big feet. Big feet like that. They are quite long. Yeah, I think they like sort of um catch fish and things with those feet, don't they? Are you in? Can you please? What do you hurt? Well, it's because you're picking at it, okay? If you stop picking at it, it probably wouldn't hurt so much. And it didn't hurt until the minute we started filming, so I'm kind of curious as to what you've been up to. Right, that's the basics, and I'm kind of working out what I'm doing on this paint, so I reckon next time I do one of these I'll be a lot faster, yeah? That'd be good if I was faster next time. I knew but what I was doing. The spinosaurus are very, very big. Very, very big. Well, I wouldn't be able to do them too big. They've got to fit on your face, haven't they? Yeah. Oh, the next day I have to be a Spinosaurus. Okay, well, I'll need to look at pictures of the Spinosaurus because, hang on, was he the one with the big um, sail up his back? Like mm -hmm. he was, oh, so he, I know the one. He kind of looks like um, a sailfish, a swordfish, a mm. marlin or something. Okay. Yeah, and he's bigger to fly a T Rex. Really? Yeah, he's tougher. He's okay. tougher. Right, back you sit. Alright, just shade these in a little bit. Very basic shading. Might put some scales on them. Yeah, let's put some scales. I got my scaly. Let's put a few scales on him and then we'll do the outlines, okay? Is that alright? Yeah. Why do you need it white? Uh, 
because the scales show up a bit then they look quite cool because I'm not entirely sure I can't remember I need to do some research onto what kind of skin these guys had I know they weren't quite feathery because they didn't get the feathers in until Archaeopteryx did they uh. Archaeopteryx is that one that looks like half bird half dinosaur mm -hmm. and they had a big fossil of them at the Natural History Museum when I used to work there so this big sort of um, stony feathery bird with sort of a dinosaur tail and claws like a dinosaur and a beak like a dinosaur. That was kind of weird. Oh, it's, they call it the missing link because it was one of the first fossils they found that they could then say, whoa, so look, some dinosaurs did start developing into birds eventually, and that's where birds and things like that came from. Let's just do a few little bits down his tummy to make him look a bit more interesting. Mom, so that's kind of your highlights, yeah? Do you know there were birds, there were birds in the twenty hour pillar, but he had teeth like us. There were birds in the what? A dog existed. Now birds and dinosaurs existed, and he had teeth. Teeth, yeah, they started developing, yeah, birds started evolving over a very slow time. Very long time, those birds. Yeah, and he had teeth. Oh. In the toes, that's a period. <laughs> Good boy. Right, I'm just going to do the outlines now, so if you can stay still as you can. Good boy. And he's doing some little stripy bits as well, because I felt like it, and I thought he might have some stripy bits, because we don't really know what colour the dinosaurs were, do we? Because the colours don't last that long. We can tell from things that have survived in fossilised cells that they did have colour. We're not sure what colours. Good boy, this is nice and still. Now, oh, got a little tuft of hair just where I don't want it to go away here. I know that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it just because I make you stay still and then you realise that things are, you can feel things? Mm hmm. Yeah, right, nice and still. Sit there. Ow. Goodness, you are. Okay. Just doing his outline over this side. That's his little arm. Up to there. How many fingers and toes do you think he has? A thousand. A thousand? Oh, he'd look like a sort of triceratops um, millipede or a centipede then, wouldn't he? Right, nice and still. Because I'm trying to come down. Stay nice and still. Wings. With wings, yeah. Can you try and stay still? Keep your arms still as well, honey bunny. No, that means keep everything. Ian, I can't paint while you're doing that because you'll make it all wiggly. Good boy. Now, usually when I have little people that are as wiggly as you, I tell them, especially if they're wanting something quite scary, I'll say to them, oh, you need to stay still, because if you wiggle that much, it's going to end up looking like a butterfly. And quite often they don't want to look like a butterfly, so they stay still. Right. What are some cars doing up there? Pardon? There's cars up there. I think I probably picked them off the floor, because you'd left them on the floor and I nearly tripped over them, which I was not happy about. Daddy hold it. Can you stay still? Daddy done it. Did he? Now stay still. I'm just getting some little stripes on him here and there because I think he might have had stripes. We don't know, but that's what I'm going to go with. Alright, I'm just going to do some highlights. Oh, do you want some teeth on him? Yeah. Thought you might because he's a definite carnivore, isn't he? 
Right, now we'll just put some little tiny highlights. I think you're the plant eater. Oh, I thought they weren't heart plant eaters. I thought um, it had all been decided that they actually ate meat. So they were, they eat meat, what are they? They are, remember the word? Carnivores. Carnivores. Okay, nice and still now. Right, you and that means stay still, okay? Feet, everything's still. Oh, hello, one of the cats is in. Smokey, was it you that brought the rat in? No, both of them. Okay, stay still. There's food there. Yeah, hi. Hi. His rat. His rat. Hi. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Yes, yes. <laughs> yeah, in a minute. Oh, dearie me. Oh, see. Yeah, <laughs> nice and still. I'm just trying to do your lines. Yeah, yeah, we'll come and get cuddled in a second. Oh my goodness, he's being a noisy cat today, isn't he? Um, you in. Hands down, hands down. Oh! Yeah, don't make the silly noises, please. I'm just trying to make you look like you're the parasol that you want to be, so you've got to give me a chance to do it. All right, well, I think that's starting to look pretty cool. So, would you like any sparkles on it? Yeah. Okay, close your eyes gently. Well, at least I've got his head looking pretty much like a pterosaur. I think we have to practice that one a bit before we get any further. No, no. Yeah, it's down the side where it always is. Mm -hmm. Hi, bear. Hi, shores. I can't see it. Um, it's down the side, just pull, oh dearie me, there we go, squiggly boy today. Can I have a look at your face? Can we look up? Can we see you? Ah, oh, dearie. Is that okay? Are we happy for today? Yeah? Oh, you and your nose, you see his wee feet? Yeah. I oh see dear. his claws. You see his claws? Yeah. I see his wings going all Hi, around Pat. the side. You see his wings going all around the side, yeah? yeah? So, you happy with that? I'll need to work on that design and have a think about a pterosaur. Hi, Shores. I haven't seen Shores in ages. Shores just had a baby, you What? Yeah. All right, okay. We're going to say bye. Do another bye. one tomorrow. Bye. Yeah. Bye, guys. We better go and see what the cat's yowling about. You want to